Hi, Tile from Inner Fidelity here. Today we're going to talk about the just amazing Biodynamic DT1350, which is this headphone. This is a small supra oral, which means the pads rest on your ears, uh, headphone, sealed headphone. Um, it's uh, a lot of metal in the construction, metal headbands, metal uh, ear pad adjustments, metal bales. Um, the the uh, cases are plastic here, the ear cups are plastic, but it's a very nice finish and very uh, nicely done plastic. I really couldn't tell they were plastic right off the bat. Uh, they have uh, very comfortable ear pads. The ear pads are replaceable. Um, they're uh, held on by adhesive, so you really have to pull fairly hard, but once they start coming, they come right off. Um, <clears throat> if you've got a uh, one of the older T50Ps, it's a similar looking headphone, it had a different ear pad originally. I would suggest that you get the new ear pads from uh, Bayer Dynamic. Uh, they're much more comfortable and they seal better up against the ear. Um, these headphones have some unique features. The headband splits like this and this allows you to uh, have them more firmly on your head. Um, good for drummers, uh, people who are outdoors and uh, uh, working vigorously for whatever reason. Um, uh, and I'll show you what that looks like. They go on your head like this. And they're very secure on your head. The uh, clamping pressure is not too high, but it is firm and uh, provides great isolation. Um, for DJs, the earpieces also rotate 90 degrees and uh, on both sides although the uh, cable is not interchangeable but the headphone is very comfortable and secure to wear in this manner as well um, the really terrific thing about these headphones is they sound amazingly good um, the bass is just bottomless uh, it's not accentuated uh, but it is uh, fairly flat and goes very, very low. So you, you'll find uh, ve them very satisfying in that regard. Uh, there's a little bit of um, uh, missing information between 2 and 7 kilohertz. Uh, so the treble is a little withdrawn there. Um, but uh, uh, square wave response shows they uh, not line up nicely and that they're quite articulate. They do... Uh, they do enunciate the highs very, very well. Um, a little uneven sounding, um, but for a headphone that's this small, uh, they really sound better than any other that I've heard. Uh, I think these are a stunning headphone, and um, I really encourage professionals, uh, audio people, especially field recording people, electronic news gathering teams, uh, uh, movie production, remote location for movie production, sound guys to really consider these headphones. They are um, remarkable, uh, both in their isolation and in the sound quality. Um, I think you should... Uh, dump your DT48s and get a pair right away. They're that good. Um, I love these headphones. Um, I want to make mention of the fact that Bayer Dynamic also makes a T50P, which is quite similar looking. It doesn't have the split headband. It, it doesn't have the ability to rotate the earpieces, two-sided cables. Um, these may look similar and they may be priced similarly, but they do not sound nearly as good. Uh, these are sold mostly through the Pro channel at, uh, for Buyer Dynamic, so you may have to look a little bit harder to find them, but it's well worth looking for the DT1350 as opposed to the T50P. Uh, T50P is a little uh, more efficient for portable use, but these play plenty loud on portables, um, and the sound is uh, remarkably better. So I really highly encourage you to look for the DT1350. Uh, I guess I should say it again. These are a great headphone. Really great. Probably the best on-ear, small, sealed headphone I've ever heard. So I highly, highly recommend them. All right. Thanks for watching today. Have a good one. We'll see you next time.